All right, so this week we're going to work on some scales. <clears throat> the finger exercise that we had gone over in the first week. will give you the finger strength kind of preparation that you'll need for these types of things. So if you ever saw the movie The Sound of Music, uh, they have that one part, Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti, Do. Uh, that's the major scale. And we're gonna try that in the G. Uh, G sounds like that. Like this. Different ways to play it. So we're gonna try to play that scale uh, for the major scale. So G A B C D E F sharp G. F sharp, E, D, C, B, A, G. So that's a good way to practice it. Say the numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, eight. Um, also, saying the names of the notes can help, okay? And so there's different ways to play it. That's one way to play it. You can also play it like this. got a printout for you that will help describe which notes you're going to be looking for. So I want you to remember to say the notes, practice that. Um, also say, try singing it. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Or try counting it with it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. So that's three different approaches to the same scale. Um, and I want you to try to do it slowly at first, nice and easy. Remember to breathe. If you have the metronome, go ahead and turn that on and use that as a kind of a, a tempo guide. And um, that'll be it. Uh, the E5 chord that we're going to work on. 7th fret, 2nd string. ninth fret, D and G strings. So it's like this. Kind of play it open there, see? And then this is like a bow diddly chord, and it's easy to play and fun. So I'm sliding that from a D5 to an E5. And you can tell it's a D because the root note, the first note you're playing, adds a D. A, B, C, C sharp, D. So that's another little lesson that we're going to go over this week and uh, have fun practicing. Try to give about 10 minutes a day. Just nice and easy stuff. Don't forget to go over the old things. Include the new things. And uh, we're going to just keep moving, all right? And keep learning uh, new fun stuff. Have a good week.